Hey guys, welcome to our YouTube channel. Today we are going to solve our skill track daily challenge using Python programming language. Before going to logic, if you didn't subscribe to our channel, then subscribe right now and make our work more meaningful. First, we'll understand our question. The program has to accept the n integers as the input and print the maximum sum of two integers where the sum of digits in the that is in those two integers are same and if there is no integer like that then we are going to print minus 1 as the output so first we are going to accept the n integers and print the maximum sum of two integers where the sum of the digits in those two integers are same and if there is no integer like that then we have to print minus one as the output so now we'll take our first test case so here we have four integers now we'll find the sum of each integer that is 15 1 plus 5 is 6 and for 81 it is 9 and for 24 it is 6 and for 36 it is 9 so here we can see 15 and 36 are same sorry 15 and 24 are same and 81 and 36 have same sum so let us pair them and find their sum that is 15 plus 24 as they have equal sum that is 6 so 15 plus 24 is 39 and then 81 plus 36 is 117 now among this 117 is the maximum number so we'll print it as our output now we'll take our another test case So here we have 5 integers, so we will find the sum, for 12 it is 3 and for 49 it is 13, for 24 it is 6 and for 99 it is 18. So now we can see that there is no sum is equal between any integers so we'll print minus one as our output now let us implement our program first we'll get our integer n and then we'll get the n integers and after that we'll have a variable called maximum sum as minus one so this will be useful for that minus one case where if the two integers do not have the same sum we are going to print minus one as the output and then we'll iterate over that is for in one in range zero comma in and for in two in range in one comma n so in 1 plus 1 comma n so here the numbers are different also the combinations should be different and that's why we are iterating like this and now we are going to check the condition that is if the sum of digits is same that is if the sum of digits of array of in one is equal to equal to sum of digits of array of in two so if the sum of the sum is equal then we are going to print the maximum sum 
as yes we are going to add it in the max sum and among them we are going to print the maximum integer and finally we'll print max sum so now we'll define the function sum of the digits so here we'll have is equal to 0 and while n num is greater than 0 yes will be incremented by num mod 10 and n double slash equal to 10 and will return yes so now let us run our program we'll pass our first test case So we have got 117 as the output, which is correct. Now we'll pass over another test case. So here we have got minus one as the output, which is also correct. Our program has passed all our given test cases successfully. <laughs> Hope you guys understand. Thanks for watching. See you next video.